welcome to the Bad Girl Jamie Show. Today's episode is to show you the vinyl that I bought brand new. And the vinyl that I bought brand new is all, not all of these are brand new. A lot of these are colored vinyl. Most of these are my, these are my colored vinyls. And the ones I bought new and the ones that are in my second bin. I haven't shown you all that's in my first bin, but I'm going to show you what's in my second bin. And this is a record that's red and it's got two artists on it and it's got Matchbook Romance backed with Motion City um, soundtrack and it's a very good record. I was surprised, I just went on Instagram, I went on Spotify, this is how I choose my records if I don't know who they are. Or I'm familiar with the band but I'm not really familiar with, if, with them enough to know their music, like I've heard of them and they're in the genre that I kind of like. And it's this beautiful 10 inch red record and I got, Hot Topics was having a great sale and Hot Topics has great sales. Our Hot Topics in Flint, Michigan at the Genesee Valley Mall has records right now until they're all gone. 12 bucks and they have several copies if you want it of um, the Toy Story soundtrack for 12 bucks. They have like four copies and they have a My Little Pony one. But I just chose this one and at Barnes and Noble for 20 for I got this one. This is Fall Out Boys, American Beauty, American Psycho, and it's on Island Records. And my favorite song on here is Irresistible, Centuries, Kids Are Nori, Uma Thurman, Jet Black Blues. I love all these songs. Every single song on here I knew I liked. I listened to it on Spotify, so I knew I liked it. And it's this beautiful, like, smoky blue color with shades of smoky gray going through it. With darker blue going through it. It's kind of almost clear, but not quite. That's what the back of it looks like. It's got a picture of the band. And Pete Wentz is looking at us. I don't like his hair blue. I don't like his hair blonde. I like him better as a brunette with, with dark hair. But And this is the inside. You've probably already seen this because a lot of people have it. But here's another one that you guys might not have ever seen before. This is Senses Fail. I like what I've heard so far. I've heard most of it, and that's what it looks like, the cover. It's Senses Fail's album, Pull the Thorn from Your Heart. I kind of like some music I heard by them. They have a pop punk remix that I really liked. I can't remember what song it was. I think it's Umbrella. But I'm not, I can't remember what song it was, but I really liked it. So if you um, see them on pop punk, pop punk remix makes, um, the insides just matches the awe uh, cover. And the best part about this is it's beautiful. The actual vinyl is this beautiful bluish gray and hot pink. It's smoky. And it's got more gray on this side. It's beautiful. That record is just absolutely stunning. This is my most beautiful, um, this is my most beautiful record that I own and I love it. I don't know why it won't go down in there. Oh, now it's going down in there. Okay, but that's a beautiful vinyl that I own. It's a very, very, very gorgeous. Okay, that's gorgeous. Another vinyl that I bought brand new is this yellow card lift a sale. I got this for 10 bucks. Hot Topics was having a sale for 10 bucks. You could buy any vinyl for 10 bucks. This album, the artwork is beautiful. Just look at that artwork. The back of it just lists the songs with this like colored. It just looks like a really cool painting. And the vinyl itself is just looks like this. And then the song to song lyrics are here. And it's this beautiful red yellow record with blue and green with like greenish green and red splatter. It's multicolored yellow splatter. Very very good. Another one I bought brand new is this Nirvana Bleach album. I got it for 16 bucks. It looks like this. It's got the band. 
got the band here. My favorite song on this album, I'd have to say, is About a Girl. That's like one of my most favorite Nirvana songs, and it looks like this. It's just plain black, but it's got fancy artwork on the, the uh, I don't know if you can see that artwork on there, but that's pretty cool. These are all records I bought. Most these ones that I just showed you are ones I bought brand new. Um, the only other ones I bought brand new are some I showed in my first one, which is my Foo Fighters, my Foo Fighters, my My Chemical Romance, Misfits, and Ramones are the only other brand new records I bought. These are some used ones, and these are some of the newer records that I bought. And these are ones that I've been looking for and I cherish because these are artists I've liked my whole life. This this band is like. If the, besides the Beatles, this is my other favorite band. I was obsessed with them in high school, and it's the Monkees. And I'm so excited to have this record. It's called Then and Now, The Best of the Monkees. The thing is just like a plastic sleeve like this, but the record label on it is plain black vinyl. Like always, most vinyls are for, that are old and used, but the condition of it is excellent. I got this record, and I was super duper excited because the Monkees are my favorite. Favorite songs on here, it's got Theme for the Monkees, Last Train to Clarksville, Take a Step, Take a Giant Step, I'm a Believer, I'm Not Your Stepping Stone, A Little Bit Me, A Little Bit You, Anytime, Anywhere, Any Place, or Any Place, Anywhere. And then on side two, it's got That Was Then, This Is Now, The Girl I Knew Somewhere, Pleasant Valley Sunday, Am I Doing, Hanging Around, Daydream Believer, Valerie, and Kicks. My favorite songs of this whole album would have to be I'm a Believer, Daydream Believer, which is my favorite monkey song, which is my number two, favorite, number three, favorite song of all time. It's number three. Number two is Tiny Dancer by Elton John, and number one is Dreams by the Cranberries. That's my number, my top three songs, and I had to have this because it's not my top three my number three song. I want to have all the venom with my top ten songs. So that's this was on my bucket list, like my major bucket list. Um I've been really obsessed with the song Valerie. Then after that I got this record and this record is a must for any Jimi Hendrix fans. It's Are You Experienced? It's his best album. It's got Purple Haze, Manic Depression, Hey Joe Love Our Confusion, May This Be Love, I Don't Live Today, and then on side two it's got Wind Cried Mary Fire, Third Stone from the Sun, Foxy Lady, and Are You Experienced? This album is amazing. I'd have to say my favorite song is probably Fire, The Wind Cried Mary, and Purple Haze, and Hey Joe. Those are the songs I love. The back of it looks like this. There's no sleeve on it, I don't think. There's no sleeve in there. It's just plain black vinyl, but it's in the record itself is in absolute condition. The cover's a little bit tattered, but into the back of it looks like that. And it's got the um, J the experience band. It's the, it's, Jimi Hendrix was never just called Jimi Hendrix. He was always called the Jimi Hendrix Experience, if you didn't know that. Another band that I absolutely adore and have on vinyl and has my favorite, my favorite arrows. My favorite songs by the band is this Aerosmith's Greatest Hits and um, Dream On, Same Old Song and Dance, Sweet Emotions, Walk This Way, Last Child, Back in the Center, Draw the Line, Kings and Queens, Come Together, and I think Come Together is a remake of a Beatles song, But I'm not sure. I haven't listened to that part of the record. And remember, Walking in the Sand. I think those last two are remakes, but the rest of them are their originals. Dream On, Sweet Emotions, and Walk This Way are my favorite um, Aerosmith songs, so I was super excited to have that. Another record I got that I don't know if I've showed you yet is the Grease soundtrack. And the inside looks like this, and they're just black vinyls. The inside looks like this, and the outside looks like this. And my favorite songs on this are probably Summer Nights, Hopelessly Devoted, You're the One That I Want, Sandy, Beauty School Dropout, Look At Me, I'm Sandra D, and Grease Lightning. My favorite song on the whole soundtrack is... Oh, We Go Together's on here too. I love that song. And there are worse things I could do. My favorite song on the whole, whole soundtrack is probably Hopelessly Devoted to You. 
And those are the records for this haul. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out my other record hauls. And on the Juggalettes R Us soon, we're going to be having um, um, a rant about the economy and the state of work in this country. It's our little rant. And then there's another one coming up about our Pokemon Go. And I'll be having a video talking about my Pokemon Go and how I've been playing and what I've got and what happened to me when I happened to me when they finally released the game and some other stuff and I want to thank you guys for watching and if you like this video thumbs it up and if you want to see more comment below what kind of videos you like me to do and I'll do them and I want to thank you guys for watching comment rate subscribe don't forget to check out Twisted J's channel and don't forget to check out the Juggalettes R Us and thank you for watching. Peace out and much clown love to the Juggalo family. I love you all.